This is the quizzical custom.js file. This file can be found within the JS folder within the quizzical file directory. At the top of the file, you will see something called the engine and question schema. The question schema is how you generate quizzes. By using this part of the JavaScript structure, you can change the content of a question, the type of question, and the answers. Quizzical has been built to make quiz generation as easy as possible. You can see here that we have three questions. If I copy question number three, go directly below it and put a trailing comma after the last bracket at the bottom of the third question, being sure to leave no trailing comma for the last bracket in the four questions, I can easily generate a new question for the quizzical schema. Everything operates on basic JavaScript array and object notation and structure. You can see for question number one, we have James House is in New York. Question number two, which of these drinks is alcoholic? Question number three, which of these animals are carnivores? And question number four, I will change to which of these animals are herbivores? The answer A and D, I can also change, this time A and B. And I will change lions into sheep. B cows is going to be correct. And sheep, I will change to crocodiles. Now we have A, B is the correct setting for this question. Sheep and cows being the right answer for herbivores. If I save this and go back to the quizzical generator, we will now see that the quiz has changed structure. Firstly, we have our same true false question. Question number two, the same again. Question number three, the same as previously. But now we have a fourth question as we added one to the schema. This question as we structured has the correct answer of cows and sheep, which if I answer generates the successful final slide. All done within the schema section of quizzicals custom.js file.